my beautiful people? Welcome back to another video with your girl Pamela Janani. Welcome back to my channel, Pamela Janani of Goddess. What is your vibe? What is up? Okay, so if you're watching and you're not subscribed, subscribe to my channel. Support me on this journey that they always say is bigger than me. God is working all around me. God is with me. I am doing great things for God. I am doing great things with you. We got a lot of great things to do in 2023, and I want you guys to be a part of it with me, okay? So subscribe, push that bell button, give me a thumbs up, spread the word of God, and let's tap into this message, okay? So in this message, oh my gosh, there's a red bird right in front of my window. Red. Wow. Okay, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. That that's that's beautiful. Okay, that's beautiful. Okay, so let's keep going. Okay, so God is saying to you guys watching, okay, I am with you. I am in the front, I am the back, I am up, I am down. We are all around you. Who are we? Your angels, okay, your spirit team your loving ancestors, the people that you have prayed for to be pr your angel. So somebody, some, some of you guys, a lot of you guys have lost people, okay? Mom, dad, sister, brother. Some of you guys have lost babies and they are, they are a part of your spiritual team, okay? They are rooting for you. They are supporting you. They are loving you, okay? And they want you to know that. They are all around you and nothing your enemy can, nothing that your enemy says, nothing that your enemy does will harm you, okay? You are protected. And if you're watching this video, claim this energy. You're protected. It, okay and trust and believe in that let's keep going they're saying they're all around you god is saying walk in my light okay we are around you they look they can look your enemies can look hello what is up mm -hmm. okay not even waving at you but you can look right they can look at you they can gossip they can slander but god says i know who you are and they cannot destroy you okay your enemies are envious of where you're going they're hating on you they know that you are going someplace okay and they're not OK, and some people, some of our enemies, they know who we are. They know where we're going and they just know and they have such such little faith and insecure. They have a lot of insecurities that they can't even go where we're going. But if they only knew if you were not wicked, OK, you can go somewhere. God has a plan for everybody, but we choose to be wicked or we choose to be good and kind. And we chose to be good and kind and they chose to be wicked. But you can even change your ways, wicked people, but they don't see or hold any value. So they want to try to take our value, okay, and put us down by doing all of this shit. But it doesn't work, okay, because we thrive. We keep going. With God, all things are possible and we are going to have everything that God says we will have, okay? Let's keep going. Um, They know that with me, God says they know that with me, powerful things happen the magic happened miracles happen and this is what they're afraid of they're afraid that with us standing in our power speaking authority and loving and being obedient to god that all of our dreams will come true well guess what enemy you're absolutely correct all of my dreams are coming true i have ascended i'm here to help you guys ascend it if you are already ascended then let's enjoy what god has in store for us okay let our enemies watch god says they can look they can look they can look and we can look back What's up? Keep moving, all right? I inspire you. If you don't want to take that inspiration that I just gave you and you still want to turn your back, that's on you, enemy. That's on you. All we can do is walk in our light, walk in our purpose, inspire people who want to be inspired. If you don't want to be inspired and you want to still plot, you're plotting on me, but you're plotting on yourself, okay? Because everything that they try to plot against us is going to happen to them, okay? Backfire. All right, so let's keep going. Um, They get scared when they see that I, okay, am all around you. When we walk, they can see the light that we hold. They can see the light. When I walk around, people can see the light that I hold. And they've always seen this light, but I didn't know I really had the light, okay? I knew that I was different, but I didn't know that God gave me this light. And they see the light. They see it in the way I speak. They see it in the way I move. They see it in my actions. And they are scared, okay? They are scared because they don't see the light that they see in us in, in themselves. And that makes them angry. That makes them envious of, of obtaining this light. And they try to steal it or kill it from, or kill it. Okay. But no, God says, no, God says, no, God says, I hold the power. Okay. Um, believe, believe, believe God had me write down that he had me write it three times. Believe, believe, believe. Um, you don't stand with me because of what you can get. God says, I know you collective. God says, I know Pamela Janani. I know you guys don't stand with me and stand in my word because of what you think that I can get for you. I'm not standing in here, okay, saying I'm obedient to God and I love God because I think I'm going to get a new car. I am going to get a new car. I'm not standing here thinking, oh my gosh, God, I love you because I'm going to get a new home this year. I am going to get a new home this year. I'm going to have everything that I want this year. Absolutely. But that is not why I am saying I love God. 
I love God when I didn't have much. I love God when my bank account was empty. I love God when my family betrayed me. I, I'm getting teary eyed. Okay. Okay, keep going. I get emotional because I've been through a lot. I love God when my mom died. Okay. I love that God when my dad died. I love God when the people that I love the most betrayed me. I did. I'm going to keep this in here because this is real. God says, I know you, Pamela. I know you collective. Love me even through your storms. You didn't have what you will have in 2023. You didn't have it. But God says, I saw you still love me. I saw you still pray to me. And that is why, yes, I, you will have everything that you want in this world, in this life. And you will start in 2023. You will lack nothing in 2023. And you will always be protected, okay, and beyond. And this is why God says, I love you, Pamela Janati. I love you. You watching, God says, I love you. Because when you didn't have much, you were faithful. Okay, and all the wicked people out there, they only love me sometimes, God says, when I provide. When they see something good happen for them, that's when they want to say, oh, thank you, God. But when they're struggling, maybe, or when they when they chose to turn, the, turn their cheek against me, God says, and they put themselves into a terrible situation, they were angry with me. And it's okay to sometimes be angry with God, and I, but they were angry, okay? They didn't hold gratitude like I do, like you do, okay? And God says, I am going to provide for me and you, collective, okay? Just wait, watch, just wait, okay? I guarantee you. Um, God says, this is why my children always went. Okay. They appreciate the storms because I called them on you. God says, I called the storms on you, Pamela. And I always knew that I said, there's a, I was in a terrible car accident when I was pregnant with my son. I mean, car total. They wondered how did I walk out of there with no scratch? Nothing happened to me. Nothing happened to me. I climbed out of a broken window with a big ass belly and not a scratch, nothing. And even when that happened to me, I saw stars. I was literally, my car was smoking all around. I thought that the car was going to catch fire and that someone broke the, what they broke the windshield. And she said, can I break your windshield? I said, absolutely. I climbed out. Okay. I could have been angry with God, but I knew that there was something in that accident that was supposed to happen. Whatever it was, I was, I said, okay, I didn't have a car, whatever. I just trusted him. And God says, you will always win when you have faith like that. You will always win, okay? They appreciate, yeah, okay, so I called them on you. God says, I called those storms on you. He called the accident to happen on me. I will never give authority to the devil doing anything that has in my life. My accident, people, when I had the accident, someone, or when my dad died, it was around the same time. They said, oh, someone said, well, you know what? All of these bad things keep happening. I said, absolutely not. I don't do that. I don't do that, okay? I will not claim that energy. I'm not gonna claim that energy at all, okay? I know that God had this accident happen for a reason. What it was at the time, I don't know, but actually right now I know why, and that's between me and God, okay? But let's keep going, all right? Um, now you will want nothing, God says. God says, I have prepared everything for you, okay? I have prepared everything for you. Almost done, let's keep going. You are stronger because I let them betray you. You are stronger because I let them betray you. And it is absolutely true. I am stronger because of the people who have betrayed me. The people who have left me, I look back at them right now and I don't miss anything because they're still the same. If you know anything about me or if they know anything about you, we're not the same. Okay. The wicked stays the same. They're comfortable in their own darkness. They're comfortable in their own skin. Okay. They shed new skin because they want to present themselves to be a better person. Okay. To other people who don't know them. Okay. But we see it all. I am changed. I am better than I was yesterday. I am better than I was a month ago, two years ago, and they are still the same. Your enemies are still the same stagnant. Okay. They were no good for you. God says, I saw what you didn't see. Now they see what I see in you. They're watching you. They're watching me. They see exactly who we are. They're watching, okay? What they should have seen in you, what they should have seen in me, they now see. Now they want to take part of our journey, okay? But they can't because they're still the same. There's no growth. There's no change. They're stagnant and devil-ass energy that we do not partic we don't participate in, okay? Some can't go where I'm taking you, God says. They just can't. God says they just can't go where I'm taking you. Because if they go where I'm taking you and you let them ride your coattail, they're going to try to destroy you from the inside out, okay? God says, I am not letting that happen, okay? 
God says, just right now, God says, there's some people who are trying to hold on to people, family members or not. You're trying to hold on to people that does not have the, their best interest for you, okay? They will tell you that I want this for you. I want the best for you. You know, you got to do this if you, God says, don't listen. Listen to me. Listen to what I place inside of your intuition. That is when you will have victory. As I said in another video, your intuition is your victory, okay? Um, let's keep going. I still see a spark of wicked in them. God says, God says, as I just said before, God says, I see people that you're trying to hold on to. They still are wicked. They may smile in your face, but deep inside in that intuition that he gives you, you know that there's something off. God says, listen to that. Okay. Use your discernment. Okay. Um, he says, so trust me, if I don't allow them to come back to you, trust me, it's for a reason. Chosen ones in spiritual tribe, okay? Stay walking in my light, God says. Close your eyes and envision it all around you. Envision yourself in this light, in this beautiful white light, this, this light that God gives us that nobody can take. Envision that in you and walk in it no matter where you go. Sleep in it and ba just bathe in it, okay? Know that it's yours. Um, that is me, God says. That is us. God says that light that you hold is me. It is your spiritual team, okay? They're all around you. Walk, run, thrive in peace, joy, abundance, and behold the kingdom together. That is it for this video. God says we are in this together, okay? I'm standing here. I'm sitting here I'm at home, right? And I'm talking to you guys and your energy, the love, the support, we're in this together, okay? We're in this together. I am in this with you. You're in this with me. And when we're in this together with clean, pure hearts, God says the world is ours, okay? The world is ours. And by ours, I'm talking about his world is ours. We are a part of his world. And with that being said, you guys already know how good that is, okay? So that is it for this video, my beautiful people. Subscribe, subscribe to my channel. Grow my channel. You're growing a channel of God. Um, give me a thumbs up. Energetically, it's, it's just sending waves of just goodness, okay? The vibrations that we hold, okay, when we're energetically supporting each other, you don't have to be in my home. I don't have to break bread with you yet, okay? But you're energetically sending me good energy that is being sent out into the world to make it greater, okay? Share my content. A lot of people need to hear the word of God, okay? Definitely, I'll see you guys in the next video. Love and light. See you guys later. Bye.